Salute to everyone in Gdynia. I'm gonna show you some tips on how I train for the flag. A lot of people wanna just jump into the flag, but you must build your delts, you must build your traps, and you also must build your core. So first, before I show you the, the, the progression of the flag, I'm gonna show you how you start building the muscles to build up to that progression. This is one of the main exercises that I utilize to train my body, my delts, my traps, and my core for the flag because you need the muscle to do the flag correctly, all right? So you, many of you have seen me do this before and that is because it helps with the progression of the flag, okay? And also you could do pull-ups, but we're gonna start here. Now that main exercise, like I said, works the traps, top to bottom. It works the delts, front to back. And your core, front, back, and side. So that's one of the main progressions to the flag. Now, this is some pull-up variations. Basic pull-ups, overhand grip. You don't wanna do underhand grip, that's more your bicep. Overhand grip is for the back. Your forearm, your tricep, and it builds the delts. All right, your traps as well if you're doing it correct. And if you're doing it correct like I've been sharing, it also builds your core, okay? Now, with them two exercises, you gotta do it consistently. You can't do it every once in a while you gotta do it all the time. And that will build the muscles to get the flag. Now I'm gonna show you the flag, and I'm gonna show you how I, which I feel everyone, should get into the flag. Instead of just jumping into the flag, you gotta know how to lay into it, all right? Put less stress on the rotator cuffs. And you must make sure you go both sides. You don't do the flag one side, and don't turn the other way. If you do the flag with your left arm on the bottom, for about five to 10 seconds. I say about five to eight seconds. You also must do it with the right arm on the bottom for five to eight seconds. So you're not lopsided. One side isn't stronger than the other side. My arm, you wanna lock it. You don't wanna just jump into it. You ease into it, all right? Then I utilize my core to lift my body. Put my legs out, lift. Okay, then that's how I do it. A lot of people do it and they just jump into it. That's wrong, you put too much stress on the rotator cuff. So when you ease into it like any of the work, it comes out right and there's less injury, less chance of injury in it. See, I'm already in the flag almost. Then I lift with my core. Okay. So that's some tips from Hannibal for King. Hopefully I see more of you doing the flag correctly.